I don't like these dogs. I'm sure they're right if they know you. The reason I don't like those particular dogs is one night a few years ago, a couple of years ago, I think I was cycling along here, and I didn't know they were there. It's like a storage yard, a builder's yard or something. And those particular dogs, if you Google... I think Fila Brasilerio or something. Fila Brasilerio dogs, they come up. They're a banned breed, I think. Certainly are in the UK. I don't know about other countries. Um, very good uh, guard dog, dog. A bit like Dobermans or something, I think. Anyway, I'm sure there was a gap at the, uh, the end there by the gate where they kind of stopped and they're barking. And as you can see from the video, I think there was there's a good five or six of them about a guard there anyway. And a couple of them got out on the road, and I was I had the road bike with the trailer, and I was hauling it down this like slope here, hauling it. I was doing well over 30 mile an hour. It was kind of just snapping at my ankles. My fear of dogs come comes from when I was younger. I was um, at an air show, and I had an ice cream in my hand, and then um, this dog and I've gobbled the ice cream and almost half of my hand with it. So. Cause, you know, I'm always wary around dogs, I don't care how friendly they are, like, or any animal, really. Like, I never put my head close to a cat's face, really. Very cautious, because, you know, I've not, nearly had my eyes clawed out before now. So, yeah, I mean, they came out on the road there, and I'm just hesitant. Every time I go by, I always go on, like, the other side of the road. Obviously, you can't do that every way. You don't know where the dogs are, are locked up, but um, this time of night now is, is kind of... You know, in Portugal it's alright if you know the area, but in areas you don't, nine times out of ten, some people just, are just let their dogs out to run around free. Um, so, you know, you just got to be careful, I guess. You, you know, you could carry a stick with you or something, or whatever, but... Or just get off the bike and walk, usually, just a good one. It's the fact that you are actually, you know, sat on the bike riding, and they kind of see it as a, uh, a plaything or a threat or something, I guess. So, yeah, there's a, one of those dogs that's got a really black face. Doesn't make him a bad dog, does it though? But um, he just looks like really evil. Really evil. And he's like the biggest one of the pack of those anyway. So uh, I'm sure that was the one that was snapping at my ankles. But uh, dogs. I've had a dog at home before chase me like, well, a few times. Again, just get off the bike rather than try and outrun the dog. Unless you are going down a really stupid hill, then yeah, you start a you stand a chance, but, uh, dog tips, get off the bike, see you later.